Welcome back to the FM Sandbox. These are exciting times. We have semi-final playoffs. The league is coming close to an end here. And um, we got an interesting match here. Uh, a little unexpected after the last episode. Uh, it's going to be a rematch of the Catanico, our top rivalry. Pinkston versus Big Blue in the semifinals. What a great place to have a rivalry match. I feel like there's a little uh, glow of a light. So I'm going to go ahead and I'll shift to shift this so I can get my little head in front here. But yes, anywho. Um, now this is kind of weird because in the last episode I thought it was going to be Big Blue against Mute City. But um, I guess it's, I don't know, I'm going to have to go back to the editor and figure out exactly what happened there. Um, let me point this down a little. Okay, perfect. So we get, now it just looks like I'm holy. Um, okay, so uh, let's let's look at, um, so yeah, um, and I know for sure I have proof that in fact, looking at the tree, it said that it was going to be Mute City versus Big Blue, but whatever. I'll take it. Big Blue versus Pinkston. Uh, Big Blue, everybody healthy. Only Ivan Dundich is suspended. Uh, Pinkston, only Bartolomeu is injured, and some dude that I don't think has played at all, a youth player. Um, so no Bartolomeu, but they got a lucky Pinky Stomper back, and when you got Pinky Stomper, you can do anything in life. Um, so let's look at the last time. The last time these guys plays, if they let me see, the last time Pinkston and Big Blue played each other was... Do, 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 here we go. And nope, they will not let me. It's really annoying how Football Manager does this. They're like, oh yeah, it's only a few months later. Um, sorry, we can't, we can't go back and look at the highlights. But the last time they played, Big Blue won the match. Um, and in the other semifinal, we got Mute City against Banton. Let's see, last time they... Uh, let's see if we can... Quick, okay, last time they played, it was a 1-1 draw. Um, so... We're going Pinkston, we're going Big Blue, this is the Catanico, this is the rivalry. What a great way to have the rivalry. I was kind of hoping it would happen in the championship match, but I'll take it. Semi-finals, Settlers of Catan, let's get this thing going. Um, who will play the winner of Mute City? I wish I could have shown both matches, but unfortunately, sometimes the game will schedule it offset, sometimes it just schedules them together. So again, it's probably something that if I got more into the editor, I could probably figure out. But let's look at the lineups here. Willie, Santo, John. As we saw in the last episode, the man is a game changer. And um, over here, his counterpart, Jimmy Araz, uh, he spent a lot of the season injured, but when he's playing, Jimmy Araz and Big Blue are flying. So, why don't we, uh, why don't we get this baby going? The teams are coming out of the tunnel. Um, they're, they're getting warmed up. They're getting pumped up. The Moon Man's in the stands. He's excited. He's going to watch this game. And we are going extended highlights. Why not? Why the F not? Um, again, I want to get that shirt that says, Why the F not extended highlights? That'd be a great shirt. Okay, so, Pinkson. Again, uh, Big Blue was my choice from the very beginning, not of the season, but of this tournament, to win it all. So let's see if they can um, make my prediction right. I don't know exactly what the wager is, but I'm just banking on the fact that Big Blue is going to win this match. Uh, but Willie Santo John, you know, he alone could win this game for Pinkston. Here we go. Another chance for Pinky Stomper. Pinky Stomper gets it to Mbabu. Mbabu tries a very hopeful shot, but I'm sure his teammates would have liked him to maybe think about that one a little more. Corner kick for Big Blue, and it is headed away. Polemico Terramoto with the ball. He gives it to just St. Guardian. Just St. Guardian sprays it out to Guardavidas. Guardavidas puts it out to Terramoto. The striker tries to cross it in, and it dodges some people. Oh, cross in the middle gets turned away by the Pinkston defense. And here comes the counterattack. These are extended highlights, so we're going to see a lot more. Pavon with the ball. Pavon crosses it. It's headed away. Gaston with a chance, but Fogel, Irving Fogel, the blue keeper, keeps that one for himself. Um, here we go. Yes, as I can tell, just to avoid, why don't we make this, uh, we'll call this action zones. Let's see. We'll put the action zones down there because in the last episode, I didn't realize that the other scores of the other games were happening right there. Willie Santo John with the corner kick, and it's headed away by Big Blue. Jorge Mera ends up with it, though, and Lima gives it the pinky stomper. Pinky stomper, yes, give it to Willie Santo John. Oh, but as soon as Willie Santo John has that ball, it's freaking like flies the honey. They need to be on him fast. Um, here we go. I, 
Pinkston starting out with the majority of these highlights here. Uh, Mbabu with the ball to Pavon. Pavon the pinky stomper to Lima. Back to pinky stomper to Pavon. And they're patient. The big blue. Oh, good shot from Pavon. And the big blue keeper um, is getting tested here for sure. Who are, who are these security guys? I like these guys in the green track suits. It kind of reminds me of some like you know, big brother state. These like weird green tracksuit security guards on the side here. I love that detail. Um, they should have a mode where you can be the cameraman. Oh, and Willie Santo John's shot goes off the post. Yes, they should have a cameraman mode where you can be the cameraman or the camera operator and you know, you gotta get the good shots or something. It's like Pokemon Snap, but for football manager. Oh, here we go, Lima, he's wide open. Oh, but he could not get it through the sea of blue players right there. And Big Blue, 30 minutes in, 13 shots for Pinkson, only one for Big Blue. What is going on here? Get St. Guardian gets it to Terramoto! And he tried to sneak it past the defenders, but they got in the way. Here we go, corner kick though. Find Jimmy Arras. Somebody needs to find that man, get him involved in the game. He is the key! Thomas Party's shot is deflected by Walker, and it goes out for another corner kick. Where is Jimmy Arras? Here we go, corner, Terramoto's shot gets headed away by Pavon on the line. And, um, okay, this is a good match. Good semi-final here. We can only imagine what's happening in the other match. Maybe both teams just decided to call it a draw and they shook hands and, you know, they're like, love each other. Um, we can only hope. We can only hope. Uh, but here we go, second half. Pinkston starts off with the ball. It doesn't matter. This is football manager. This is just a tease. It's not the real highlight. No shots on target yet for Big Blue. Uh, very shocking. I mean, they've got all their players, essentially. So, Pinkston is just uh, really working it on them. Oh, here we go, Pavon. Oh, my gosh. Each time, every time someone gets the ball right there on the top of the box, or if it looks like they have a little space, I'm expecting a long shot for a goal. This is Football Manager 2018, of course. Actually, this is the Settlers League, powered by Football Manager. Here we go. Pinkston. Oh, it's stolen away from Gonzalo. What an interception. Gonzalo finds Terramoto. Terramoto's shot is saved by the Pinkston keeper. Holy moly. I thought for sure that was going to be a goal. Guardavidas to Gis St. Guardian. Gis St. Guardian to Guardavidas. He crosses it in. Oh, and Jimmy Arras. Jimmy Arras was waiting there, but the Pinkston defense are playing well. Um, here we go. Big Blue with another chance. Gis St. Guardian. To Guardavidas, Guardavidas has shot everybody. I swear, both teams' mentality here is if the other team has the ball, make a big glob of players in the box. They can't score if we just have a big glob of players in the box. 60 minutes in, and this one might be going into extra time where it could be decided by golden goal or it could be decided by penalty shootout. And uh, Pinkston just subbed in Bohan. So Bohan has been having a pretty good playoffs. I think he's scored in both playoff games that Pinkston have had. So um, maybe uh, putting him in what might be what they need to uh, get the edge over Big Blue. Um, oh, here we go. Bohan is... Oh, I, I thought they were going to the VAR to see if that was a penalty. But it was a good slide tackle. Great defense by Big Blue. Who've caught up. You know, uh, if you think about it, they, it was like in the first half, Pinkston had 13 shots. They've only had three in the second half. So whatever uh, team talk the manager did there is clearly working for Big Blue. 50-50% uh, perception until just now, 51-49. It's really even game. This is the Catanico. Both teams, they hate each other. The fans hate each other. The, uh, the cats from each town hate each other. Everybody hates each other. So, you know, um, it won't... It, oh, my gosh! Oh, oh, saving it away. Here we go. We're getting close. We're getting down to the wire here. Who can pull away? Jimmy Raz heads it down to Luan. Luan has been having a great season, a great signing for them. Guadavidas. Oh, he's got space to cross it. Jimmy Raz's shot. Oh, my hands just farted. Um, Jimmy Raz's shot gets saved by the keeper. And um, six minutes left. Uh, gosh, my prediction. My prediction is it's it's on thin ice right now, but here we go. Maybe Big Blue can pull away. Double enter to the Hawk. Hawk finds Guardavidas. Guardavidas. They're trying to patiently see if they can break away from this Pinkston defense. It looks like Pinkston's kind of pressing. They are definitely, uh, yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I thought we've seen an own goal like that before. 
Oh, but you, oh, you think, oh my gosh, it keeps changing possession in the midfield. Good job by Pinkson. This is wide open. He crosses the corner. He's hot finds Dwayne Love. Dwayne Love's shot hits the corner. Oh my gosh. Dwayne Love's shot hit the post. It fell in front and Willie Santojohn finishes the chance. 85 minutes left and Pinkson are trying to book themselves a place in the final. Dwayne Love ended up with the ball and Willie Santojohn, you know, he'd been kind of quiet all game, but that was it right there. That was it. Oh my gosh, 1-0. Um, you know, not the most, I was hoping for like a 5-4 match, but you know what? This has been pretty exciting. Um, here we go. Four minutes left. Jimmy Raz with his free kick. Oh, uh, Luan with it. Luan is going to try to shoot it through all these people. No, he's going to look for the cross, and the cross ends up getting intercepted. Here we go. Jimmy Raz with another chance, and it hits the wall. Oh, Luan. Oh, no. Here we go. Pinkson nailing the coffin. Oh, Pinky Stomper gets it to Pavon. Pavon. That is a good man to get it to. Pavon crosses it, and it is uh, a little not, not close enough. Fogel kicks it up to the field. And um, Big Blue desperately need this ball. They got a minute and a half left. Ackerman finds Bohan. Bohan puts it out to Pavon. Pavon tries to cross it, but now Jimmy Raz has it. Here we go. Here's the last chance. Last chance for Big Blue. Big Blue. Jimmy Raz finds Despacio. Despacio crosses it. Luan's header misses, and that may have been it. Or no, the keeper saved them. Here we go. Corner kick. Nothing. Only 30 seconds left about Zaracho. Oh yeah, yeah, Kahneman to Silvertail. Silvertail, find Jimmy Raz. No, he cannot. And oh, here we go. Last chance. Last chance. Oh, and he passed it. See, now that was a moment to be selfish. That was the moment to be selfish. And Pinkston now, I think, will end this. Seven seconds left. Five seconds. This is over. Party. Yup. Welcome to the first ever Settlers Catan Finals. Thanks to Willie Santo John and his poacher's effort uh, puts them past my prediction. So for this next episode, there's going to have to be a big punishment for me because I chose Big Blue to be the winner of this tournament. So we'll, we'll, I'll have to stay tuned and find out because um, you know what. Uh, Pranay, maybe you're watching this episode. Who knows? Um, all right. So Pinkston booked them place into the final. Let us see the highlights of the other match. Who will Pinkston play in the Settlers final? Sip Giuseppe with the chance to put Mute City in the lead in the semifinals. Giuseppe takes the penalty and it's saved by Wolfwood and he collects it up. Our Banton with the ball. They look to take advantage of the missed penalties. Eloise with the goal. Off the cross from Sarsoga with the penalty kick. He is the penalty kick master. 2 0 up for Banton. Banton passes it out to Sar. Sar with the chance to cross it in. He does, and it's an own goal for Banton um, against Mute City. Emre Moore with the consolation for Mute City, and Foundamar gets the consolation. But it's Banton going to the finals. Okay, so I think uh, we kind of could have predicted this. Um, the finals, we're going to have Banton versus Pinkston. Banton, who have been a very strong team, and they, um, they were not challenged by Mute City. Mute City, who held the first place for the longest time this season, but ultimately fell short, and Big Blue fell short. There's no third place match in this league. You know, it goes straight to the finals. Who cares about a third place? There's nothing. Maybe one day. Maybe I'll add that in an editor where a third place also gets continental qualification. But still something I haven't been able to figure out. But here we go. Let's, let's look at the table. Um, let's see back at the league table here. So Pinkston is a second place team. Banton came in fifth place. So this is a battle of two top five teams. They definitely deserve to be here. Um, Pinkston... Uh, their, let's, their manager is Juan de Ramos, the Spaniard, and uh, Banton, their, um, their manager is Rafa Benitez. Okay, I didn't know that. Was, Rafa Benitez has got Banton firing. So it's going to be a battle of the Spaniards, a battle of the Spanish managers. Let's look at the last time these two teams played each other. Hopefully we can see the highlights. Uh, last time they played, it was a 3-0 victory. Let's watch the highlights of... The last time they played where Banton destroyed Pinkston. Um, 
so it's going to be a revenge match for Pinkston. What a perfect way to uh, start it off with a penalty kick. Jarrett Soga with the goal. And uh, it was really all bent in this match. Um, obviously, it's 3-0. Valencia got an, a great goal himself. I wonder if we even watched this episode. We may have. Uh, Kasimyar uh, on the corner kick. It got deflected away, but he tries again. And it is an own goal by Dwayne Love, who was the hero in this last match. Um, so, yeah. That's what we have it as. Um, it's going to be, uh, it's going to be fun. Uh, it's going to be a great final, um, and I definitely need some sort of. Uh, let's look at the let's look at the table to see it all. Uh, Pinkston, they, um, you know, we'll recap this in the next episode. So that was the semifinals. That was the Catanico. Uh, Pinkston got revenge for losing the Big Blue earlier in the season, and now they have booked themselves a final against Banton, second versus fifth. Who will be the champion of the Settlers League? You can only find out, or I can only find out, or Prene can only find out, since there's probably only two people watching this. But if you tune in, it will be the championship time. And uh, until that time, take care, party people. Uh -huh.